Ace got talk, I'm the truth. And there's a lot of things I don't say because I don't want to upset people. But you know what? I don't care. So let me break this one down. There's a disconnect. And there's a disconnect between the, the generation above me, my generation, and the next generation. You could do the maths. I'm talking Windrush first generation, then they had children, which is my generation. Then we've got the youngers and then the youngers under them. Now let me break down the disconnect. You see Windrush, you see Windrush generation that come over here. You lot have got a lot to blame and a lot to answer for. And you guys need to take responsibility. I'll break it down. First generation wind rush that came over here, you never left nothing. You never left nothing for us, man. My generation, you never left nothing. And I'm not talking about the little one dead house, because that's, that's what most of that gen, all right, you worked hard and you, you bought your little one house and other than that one little dead house where the government's going to take 40% capital gains tax or 40% inheritance tax, no matter how you slice it or dice it. Other than that, you've not never done much for us. And the whole life insurance thing is another thing I'm going to be pushing hard, yeah, because that's another thing. Like black people, we don't take out enough life insurance. It's not standard procedure. You know what I mean? Generational wealth. And passing down that wealth from generation to generation. So the next generation, it's a, it's a relay race. It's a relay race. You're meant to do the first leg and pass the baton. So when the man them like us is coming up, yeah, there's something for us. Because after stuff that we went through, we, sh we didn't have to go through it if you lot had set the pace right. Yeah? A lot of us, man, my gen, we had to do road hard. Because there was nothing for us. But guess what? You see all them man there that we went to school with, all them Indian man there? Well, you know the thing. From them man that come out of school, big car, house, walking into daddy's business. And you can't blame them. Because a lot of them came after us and are doing better than us. Look at the Polish. They've only been here the last 10 years, Arsa, and they're killing the game. Did you know Polish is the second most spoken language in England right now? It's got to do the maths. So, the elders, you've got a lot to answer for. Because you came over here and you never left nothing for us. Nothing. Not even a little life insurance. Right, there's a small percentage that, that do do life insurance, but I'm talking about the majority. It's not standard procedure. I break it down, generational wealth. All right, and then let me tell you, last but not least, how you, old, how you elders keep messing up. See that generation, yeah? You don't never... All right, there was, there was, there was some man them that was on road, but the majority of that generation, you look came over and you abided by the laws, you know, and you worked hard, you know, and you done the best you could by your kids. So you look don't really understand road life right now. You don't understand road life, but it's that generation I've been watching all year, all year, on all of these WhatsApp groups, the, the elders, to all the things that are wrong with the, the kids, and we need to do this, and we need to do that, and we need to do that, and you bypass my generation, bypass man, and go straight to, do you see where the disconnect is? Are we doing the maths? Am I making sense? You lot didn't come from that. But yet you're trying to offer solutions to the youths them down there. And those youths are emulating badness from my generation. They're following us. The space that we set. So, let's do the maths. Who would be the best person to connect with those youths? Because it's not you lot. It's not you lot. So who would be the best person to actually engage with those youths, who understand those youths from a point of view of been there, done it, worn the t-shirt, understand exactly what you're going through and possibly the reasons why you might be making the choices that you're making because I've actually did it myself. So Ace Got Talk, man's the truth. Stop trying to marginalise man. And all you gatekeepers, don't let me ever start kicking open gates again. 
do the maths. It's got talk. Put some respect on it. <laughs>